You know those times when you go into the souvenir shop and you just see something you say, what in the world is that? Yeah, I had that moment. Look at this. Ammo pack. Cyrus Wakefield's original ammo pack. Cartridge candy, musket ball candy, and black powder candy. What? Come on. Cartridge candy, so it shows as a gumball, a fruit powder, and you untwist and pour. Hold cartridge upright, untwist and pour it down your muzzle. Let's see. All right, we're gonna open it up. So the first is the fruit flavored cartridge candy. Here it is. So you can feel there's a gumball down there at the end. See what we got here. Unwrap this a little bit. Huh. It's weird. It's like, um, Reminds me of a pixie stick, but um, not as powdery and multiple flavors. So uh, looking at the ingredients, it says uh, fruit punch, raspberry, and cherry. Look at this. So here's what it looks like. So it's a lot more coarse, but it's just malic acid in different flavors. A lot more coarse than a pixie stick, but similar flavor. Oh, it's pigs a stick of malic acid. I have to look into that. It's good though. Mm. It's not overly sweet either. Um, curious about that gumball now. The delivery system sucks. This wax paper that it's in, I don't know if it doesn't do a good job of keeping the moisture out because it's kind of clumpy. Maybe if they had one of those incandescent packs or whatever inside of here uh, to keep the moisture out of this because the wax paper don't do it. Oh, oh wow, mm. all of it at once, mm. well, good job, wow, oh, I guess I could have just took in this rubber band off, look at that, and there's the gumball right at the end, oh, I think there's still more of that stuff in there, yeah, there's the gumball, and there is more, all right, now we got it all. Yeah. Just regular gumball. Nothing spectacular. The candy was quite good, though. I'm going to pick my garbage up. Can't let that run around. Now there's two more things in here yet. There's a black powder candy. Oh, black powder. And musket ball candy. Musket ball is a hard candy. Do not try to bite the bullet. Oh, bite the bullet pun. Uh, 
black powder candy, fruit flavored powder. Huh. You know, and I seen all the black, I really thought maybe this was gonna be uh, like a black licorice thing. Let's see what this is. Oh, it's really, really kind of moist too. Like, um, it's not dry. You definitely need to do something to help remove the moisture from these bags. Um, unless it's supposed to be like this, because it's kind of like uh, that kinetic sand. Yeah. You know, when you, yeah, you mold that kinetic sand, that's, that's just kind of like, kind of worries me now, like I'm eating kinetic sand. Oh. Oh, they lie. <laughs> that ain't fruit flavor at all. It tastes like crap. And it was hot. Like, it's not hot in the store. So I don't know from walking to the store just to my truck if that got that hot, but it's like hot and sticky. Just not good. Not as good as the other stuff was. All right, let's bite the bullet. Let's see what these are. It's probably going to be something like um, hard, hard candy, like a lemon head or something, or a jawbreaker. Oh yeah, definitely a jawbreaker. I think. I can't really tell. There's not much flavor to it. I really wanted to say black licorice, but I don't think it is. Oh yeah, wait. There it is. Yeah. Very, very mild black licorice taste. Almost can't even taste it. Mm. Well, the black powder candy, I'm gonna give that a zero. The musket balls, maybe they have more flavor to them. Give them like a two, three, I guess a three. Cartridge candy was definitely my favorite in the group. And uh, I'm gonna stick that one with a five because like the flavor was good, but it was just moist and sticky. And like there needs to be some, some of the moisture packs in here to pull them out. Um, the way they're a little more dry. Um, flavor was good though. Oh, interesting. Thanks.